Hello everyone and oh, welcome to all new subscribers and a note to new subscribers and to everyone else that has subscribed to the channel. Make sure that you tick the bell and click all notifications so that when I drop a video you guys will be the first to know. So with that said, welcome to the channel. Hope you enjoy yourself. And here we go. We're playing The Sims 3 as you can see. And I'm going to introduce you to our characters and give you a little background story. It's not a huge background story or anything like that. But we have David Du. Yes, it's David Du. And that was so funny that I had to keep it. Both of their names are randomized. It's 7 in the morning. David's sleeping. He's an athlete. And he's he wants to be a, a come he wants to become a, a superstar athlete, and that's what he's doing. They live in Sunset Valley. That's because that's the only team that would take David is the Sunset Valley Diggers. So. He's happy on the team, you know, he's not a starter or anything yet. But he's very happy to be signed to a team and he's going to prove his worth. He's, uh, his favorite music is pop, favorite food is spaghetti, his favorite color is green. He's brave, he's handy, he's a bookworm, he's athletic. And he's a computer whiz. He just finished reading his athletic book. So that's why that's up there. And I think he goes to work today. Yeah, he goes to work in nine hours. I was about to tell you his sign. Just in case. Oh, his work stuff looks good. That's good. So he should be getting... This is the book he finished reading. Um, what am I looking for? He's a Leo. And over here, we have Evelyn Madeline, his girlfriend for over three years. In fact, and their four-year anniversary is coming up. Um, she's thinking that they're going to have to forgo their fourth-year anniversary, but David has a surprise for her. He has something set up for her. And you guys will see that probably in the next part or the part after that. We'll see. But he does have something set up for her. She's uh, wanted to be a star news anchor. So she's in the journalism career. Her favorite music is hip hop. Her favorite food is hamburger. Her favorite color is lilac. Uh, she's a natural cook. Genius. Bookworm. Charismatic. And she's a computer whiz. As you can see here, she's a Scorpio. So she's on her way to work. I'm gonna let her go ahead and do that. She put in her and David. This is their first time living together, living together full time. Because, you know, they would live together part time. I mean, part time means that she had her own place. He had her own place. Bye, Evelyn. Have a good day at work. And, you know, they would stay with each other days at a time, part time. And they're living in this one bedroom trailer. They will upgrade 
to a larger house as they will as you know their money grows but right now uh take it easy meet your co-workers because she wants to meet all her co-workers let's check on david he can get up i've already started playing with them like i played with them for two sim days what is that what is that He'll be up soon. I don't know what that is. But he'll get up. She made macaroni and cheese, so they've been working off her leftovers. And she made some waffles. Xavier can cook, right? Oh no, I was going to give him natural cut, but then I decided to give him handiness, you know, to save him some money. Because he does want to marry Evelyn. I mean, that's his long-term girlfriend, long-term girlfriend. But they just don't have the money yet, and he, they both just decided that you know they want to get up in their careers a little bit and save some money and David wants her to have the wedding of her dreams plus the honeymoon of her dreams I hope I have World Adventures installed in here I don't know if I do or not because I don't have all the Sims 3 packs and Hopefully, I will one day have all the packs. I can do an all-in-one. And um, that will be great. Keeping my fingers crossed. It'll happen. I'm going to put it out there in the universe that it'll happen. You have already read that book, Clean Up. And you need to come jogging. And he lives really close. They live really close to the gym. So he can come jog here. Jog here. Don't break his sweat. They moved from the city to the suburbs of Sunset Valley. Sunset Valley is my favorite world. Sunset Valley is my favorite world in The Sims 3. It's hot today, so he's as they're in summertime. That's why he's able to. We're not getting a dot boy. You already had to fix your phone. None of this has to do with your career. Let's pause because. They will take. I want him to get some exercise in here. Oh, good. The treadmill is empty. But as you know, as soon as you send your Sims here, the lot will fill up fast. He's sore, poor thing. He's going to be sore for four hours. And yeah the stove so he said the waff waffles were uneven cooking that was from the waffles he ate and it's because they had that very cheap stove 
even though we purchased the house furnished, we're gonna say that the furniture that is in there, that they brought along with them, except for the kitchen stuff, everything in there was from the kitchen, and uh, they brought their own refrigerator because the unit did not come with a refrigerator, and it's their first starter home. It did come with everything else, the stove, the, and the counters. And the stove would, I mean, not the stove, the seasons are floating in here. I was gonna say what's wrong with your hair, but that's his hat. You don't need you, you need to do that. <laughs> we'll get his. He wants to learn writing, but he doesn't need that right now. And I'll tell you why later on why he doesn't need it right now. Even though they're not. I haven't officially sent them to university. We're gonna say they're both college graduates. And he was on the college team. He wants all this stuff. Oh yeah, they don't have a CV, so we will buy a CV. We'll figure it out. They have very small. Space because they're living in, like I said, a one bedroom trailer, so space is limited. We're not gonna get the TV. We'll make sure your next home, or if I upgrade, you know, tear down the trailer and upgrade the lot to a small home or whatever, we'll see. <laughs> Oh, Hagley. He'll have to go to work soon, and she'll be getting off very soon. Nepi Zeka Boo Sadurpa Ripsy Nerf Ubana Tumbo Bobanan Swago Pokra Swap She's on her way home Boba Frog Changasor Geeker And he needs to go to work like now Jana I'll let him run for a few minutes. He can stop because he's already sore. And I don't want to torture him anymore. And he's pumped. He can use the bathroom at work. And that's his work in uniform that they gave him. But I think we have a good day at work. <laughs> And you, my dear, let's, um, no, not go yet. Let's recycle this and recycle that, because it went bad. Is there another paper? I don't know. 
She just, I don't know why that turned. Well, let's read the paper. Let's check weekly events and check the weather. Good job, David. You wants to meet a supernatural. Meet your teammates. He'll be home later tonight. We wasn't home when he got home last night. We were at the movie theaters. Right, Evelyn? Evelyn's last name, if I didn't mention it, is Mattingly. Mattingly. Let's see. Bouncing baby born last night. The Keaton household welcomes a healthy 7.5 pound baby boy named Quentin to the household. The child is now resting at home comfortably. Uh, congratulations to the Keaton household. But it, you already know that Justin Keaton Justine Keaton is already pre-pregnant when you come in here. What is this? What is this? Chess tournament. We're going to go and do the chess tournament. Uh, headline hotspot. The hottest spot in town is Varg's Tavern. That's where the vampires hang out. Ew, today is a high of 75, a low of 47, and it's sunny. Tomorrow's going to be light rain with a high of 93 degrees, low 63 degrees. These are in Fahrenheit. Thursday, light rain with a high of 83 degrees Fahrenheit. And in The Sims 3, you can change um, your weather into Fahrenheit or Celsius in your options panel. Depending on what country you live in or if you just like to count degrees in Fahrenheit or Celsius. I and the United States, so I do Fahrenheit. Is Friday is going to be sunny with a high of 92 degrees Fahrenheit, low of 63 degrees Fahrenheit. Saturday is going to be a high of 67 degrees Fahrenheit. It's going to be sunny with a low of 51 degrees Fahrenheit. And Sunday it's going to be a high of 97 degrees Fahrenheit. It's going to be sunny with a low of 66 degrees Fahrenheit. I wonder why it's going to be 67 degrees on Saturday. Hmm. What events do we have going on? That was it. No events for the week. Oh, chess tournament today from 4 to 11 p.m. And it's raining. I don't think I gave them umbrellas. Umbrellas. Or is it? No, it's not raining. But it's going to rain. I'm going to have to give them umbrellas. Can you believe it? They just moved into their house and they got bills the next day. It was like a hundred and something dollars in bills. They just moved here. Win three chess games to earn some money. Okay. Is there anybody come out here to this tournament? Sorry about that. The graphics always does that. 
Where is a table? Oh, she found it. We're the only one at this chess tournament. Are you going to play against us? Hmm. If it's an opportunity. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, we'll play with her. two people that showed up. Stop playing so you can play with her. Sit down. Because she got to win three. And that means you have to have an opponent. opponent. He's a teen. And a bad teen. Is that. That's Mirage. I forgot what his last name is. Okay, we got some more people out here. Oh, that's the Alto wife. Nick Alto's wife. I know it starts with a V, and I can't remember. I think it's Vera Alto. Oh. <laughs> mm. Vita Alto. What do you want, Vita? Stop. <laughs> Come on. Vita, no. get out the way. <gasps> no. She tried to get us up. Come back here, Jenna. I don't want to play with you, Vita. Well, she means generally, you're so entitled, Vita. Just because you're rich doesn't mean you can run whoever you want off the chess table. Don't you have a chess table at home? Don't you have enough money while you're at this tournament? This is for the struggling. Now shoot. Bolivia, Quibby. Oh, hmm. There's Justine Keaton. Hmm. She just had her baby and she's already out here. She's now a fairy. Yeah, Vita's in a political career. While her husband, Nick, is in... The, um, business career and they have a tumultuous marriage let us sir know Come on, Evelyn. Beat no. her. Beat her no. pants up. Oh. We're getting hungry. Mm. Mm. You wanna she dog? Ah. <laughs> See, this is why I didn't want to play against her. She's she won that one. We're not gonna win. We gotta win three. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna tell him to go here when he gets off. He can treat us out to dinner. He wants the pillow fight. Well, it's in. She already pillow fought him, so they'll pillow fight. It's his turn to get her back. Because she was winning. So, he's very competitive. There goes Erin Kennedy, one of my favorite Sims in Sunset Valley. 
He got a one dollar mm. raise. Mm. Ah. Sarge. Uh, for not of talk. She just got a logic point. <laughs> Come on, Evelyn, you can do it. Oh. oh, did we get a promotion? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, we did. He works from three to nine, and he now makes twenty six dollars per hour. Everybody's getting hungry. I said, go here. I told this man to come here. He went home. Evelyn texted him that she was at a tournament. Office hero. Hmm. Cause he's mm. always wondering where she's at. Like last night, he didn't check the bedroom, but he saw her. That's the Langerick little girl. Yep, Kaylin Langerick. Hmm. Ah. Uh. No, he's here. <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. Oh, well, the time is over. He can take us out to eat. Where are we gonna go? The only place we can go is Hogan's right now. Uh, with others, Evelyn, he got her text. After he got home and he came straight here. Oh, and then she's that. like, meet me at the tournament. Do hard. I enter a chess yeah. tournament. Go eat with your man. Zappy Dima. That's his car. They have. They need to save up money because. When they were living in the city, she would take public transportation and he's always had his car since high school. She's never had a car, and they do need a second car. Because sometimes she takes his car, and then he has to take a cab, and they're really trying to save their money. She was like a little upset with him. She was like, I texted you and I told you, you know, to come straight here. What took you so long? And he was like, I didn't get your text until after I got home and I got comfortable. And then I saw it. 
And he was like, I didn't check my phone all day. And he was like, as soon as I saw it, I got here. I came. And now we're going out to eat. They haven't, well, they went to um, a game, but they couldn't go together. They didn't go together, but they went, wound up going at the same game. Because, only because Evelyn changed her mind at the last minute and decided to go. But he was already there. They took a few classes when they got here. Don't, she's like, don't you leave me. He's like, I'm not leaving. I was just back in the car up so we can get on our way home. And he did tell her that she can come in here and take her shower and stuff first. <laughs> she just needs to shower. And then he'll take his shower after her. Do we have bad food? What are you doing? Oh, he's cleaning. Cool. Well, you guys, I'm going to end this part here. This was the first part of Let's Play The Sims 3. Hope you guys enjoy. And um, I'll see you in the next video. Remember to stay hydrated. Stay cool. And stay calm. And I'll see you in the next part. Bye.